Okay, so who can solve this HVAC problem? So here's a question I got from the field that I've never received before. Let's see if we can solve it together. So here's the scenario. You have 150,000 CFM air handling unit. Your entering air conditions are 51 degrees, 90% relative humidity, which you've measured in the field. You've measured your return air conditions at 73 degrees. This is dry bulb, 63% relative humidity. And you've measured your supply air temperature of 59 degrees, dry bulb, 70%. All right, so here's the question. How much outdoor air in terms of CFM is this unit bringing in, provided you know the entering outdoor air temperature, the return air temperature, and the supply air temperature, and the supply CFM? Let's go to the psych chart to try and figure this out. Okay, so you don't need a psych chart to figure this out, but this is always a great visual representation to me. So I've plotted the two points, which is 51 degrees dry bulb and 90% RH. Over here, you will see, and that's your outdoor air, you have your return air of 73 degrees dry bulb and 63% RH. And we know, because we've watched all of the Psychrometric 101 videos, that the mixed air temperature is going to lie on a point that connects these two points. So when you have two air streams mixing, if you draw a line between them, that's where your mixed air temperature is going to be. The mixed air temperature reading we have is 59 degrees, which is right here. So you can tell, one of the things you could tell first off is if you had an equal mixture of 50-50, your supplier temperature would be somewhere around here, or I should say your mixed air temperature. Okay. You can tell since it's colder than that, that you have more outside air than you have return air, right? That would make sense. So the way to calculate the outside air is to take the temperature difference here and divide it by the total temperature difference, and that will give you your percentage. Now, one important thing to note here, look where this temperature is in terms of relative humidity. This is 80% RH, but the field reading was at 70% RH. So what does that mean? Well, what it means is field readings aren't always 100% accurate, but we're going to go with what the dry bulb is because that's really all we need to calculate the percentage of outside air. Okay, so the percentage of outdoor air is directly proportional to the temperature difference of 73 minus 59 divided by 73 minus 51. So 73 minus 59 is 14, 73 minus 51 is 22. When you divide those two, it's 0.64 or 64%. So the answer is 96,000 CFM of outdoor air. So here's a bonus question. If this is truly your supplier condition, do you need to turn on the cooling? So if you calculate the dew point here, it's 49 degree dew point. In my experience, you would not need to turn on the cooling at 49 degree dew point. Of course, that depends on your application.